We started building the boom and mast at the beginning of the year. They were built on this site here in place. And uh, we went from there. On August 3rd, we walked the machine up onto the pad and proceeded with um, getting things reeved up so we could lower the boom, remove the boom from the machine, and then lower the mast to the ground, and then begin the work of removing the mast and pinning the new boom and mast on. Uh, there was some option. We've repaired the boom so many times that the iron is fatigued out and welded in so many places. And with the advantage of the longer boom and boom angle, the production that we'll gain out of it with the further reach and not having the additional equipment to strip the extra dirt that we'll need will pay off in the long run. We start with, in the cab, we'll have a meeting with um, electricians and the mechanics that will be on the machine while we raise the boom, discuss the plan for, for raising the boom, and then we'll go ahead and do a stall test of our motors to make sure our brakes hold so everything's safe. And then from there, we'll come back into the cab, have another meeting, talk about safety, talk about all the things we need to watch, and we'll stage people throughout the machine. And right before we start, we'll do a radio check to make sure we have good communication with everybody at the machine, and then we'll proceed to raise the boom. The main thing is we watch is the, the drum with the hoist ropes or even ropes, the sockets that are fixed to the machine that are holding the boom and mass in the air. Them are our priorities to make sure that they don't slip. That's a automatic hold. So we're looking for major things, things that could cause damage to the machine. If it has no damage to the machine, we're gonna to continue to go up the teller pin. It's been a good project. It's gone very well. Things have fit up very well. You know, all in all, it'll be the performance that the machine will give out once with this new boom on it will be the huge benefit to everybody.